How inappropriate to call this planet Earth, when it is quite clearly ocean. The poignant truth is that we know so little about deeper marine habitats. But these unexplored depths are now conveniently within range of our deep sea submersible. When I first started diving in the late 60s, nobody had been diving for 25 years. A lot has changed since then, and now most of the diving areas around the planet have been explored to depths down to about 100 and 180 feet. Many, many, many people 
all over the world have completely exploited the shallow water. I don't mean that in a bad way. I mean that a lot of people have dived, and both you know, researchers and scientists and sport divers, filmmakers, photographers. It doesn't matter where you go. You go to Antarctica, British Columbia, the Cayman Islands. People have been there. If you like the idea of exploring, if you like exploration, if you yearn to go places where nobody has been before, see animals that nobody has seen before, then you can still do that on this planet. You just have to go deep. So there's this feeling of privacy, you're, you're, you're out there, the world is in front of you and you're the only one there. It's just a fantastic feeling. You're almost certainly going to see things that nobody's ever seen before and you're going to see species that are yet to be described by science. You feel like you've just done something that very few have ever done. Being the first to explore deep walls and survey untouched undersea mountains while documenting new species is a natural fit for the capabilities of Deep Sea. Deep Sea is a custom-built one-atmosphere submarine capable of carrying a pilot and two passengers to a depth of 1,500 feet. She is a flexible, capable, and masterfully designed vehicle. She agilely operates with precision throughout her range in complete comfort and utmost safety. The view from Deep Sea's cockpit is unparalleled with a 360-degree field of vision. The four-inch thick acrylic sphere actually disappears when immersed, giving the exhilarating sensation of total freedom. A full-motion mechanical arm enables Deep Sea to accept additional external cameras, collect samples, and even deploy and retrieve instruments. Deep Sea is equipped with an impressive array of HID lights and remote-controlled high-definition video cameras that document all of her dives, while passengers also use their own video or still camera equipment from inside the acrylic sphere. Look, 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 look. Wow. Oh my God, that's fantastic. Wow. Look at that. I was amazed. I was amazed at the things that we saw uh, on videotape coming back from the submersible. I had no idea those colors existed. I had no idea that many of those animals uh, existed, yet alone lived at Cocos Island. And I spent hundreds of days diving at Cocos, but deeper than I was capable of going, it's an entirely different world. That's magical. And those opportunities are available. Working with Undersea Hunter, you've got a whole world of new places to explore. There is absolutely no doubt that submarine stacks up against any sub-operation that I've been with. I'm comparing it to a lot of different submersibles that I've dived in, some of which I can, I'm a pilot for. When I was in the Sea of Cortez with the deep sea operation, I had nothing but appreciation. Deep Sea's partner in exploration is her mothership, the Argo. Designed and fit specifically for this support mission, while hosting her guests in total comfort. A state-of-the-art vessel, luxurious, uh, ready for, for people who want a bit of luxury while they're at sea going for exploratory dives. We can lose each other here. Uh, there is so much space and there's so many interesting areas of the boat to, to go to. The cabins are spectacular. Everyone with a private bath, nice paintings on the wall, and they can adjust the thermostat, and oh look, a nice flat screen, I can look at the video that I shot today, and these things mean a lot. We know that the full experience of exploration and adventure occurs topside as well. There's so much interesting stuff on the boat to look at in the quiet moments, but I must admit, I haven't found any quiet moments, I have to say. 
Something's been happening all the time. Yeah. We are committed to making your expedition or underwater project one of the most successful, unique, and rewarding experiences of your life. Since its inception in 1990, the Undersea Hunter Group has been strategically based in Costa Rica. With elegantly designed boats and a global reach, the group has grown to become the finest adventure, film production, and scientific study operation available for charter today. Maybe it's personal adventure you seek, or capturing extraordinary scenes on film, or perhaps expanding our scientific understanding of the planet through precisely planned and meticulously managed expeditions. It's this unique opportunity to see things that you've never seen before. Often no one has ever seen. And what you saw was mind-blowing. I don't care what you have done in your life, you've not done that and you haven't seen those animals, and you do appreciate that opportunity. Many years ago, Avi and I talked about this dream that we share, but now it's actually a possibility to take a boat like this, go anywhere on the planet, support deep technical diving and submersible dives, and I think that's just enormously exciting. You can climb a mountain because it's there, or be among the very few to explore the deep ocean, because for the first time, now you can. What's your mission? Where could you go? What could you see? Who would you take with you?